Welcome to the first ever LEGO Super Mario stream. I'm your host, Jack, and I couldn't be more excited to be here celebrating Mario Day with you and to show you some of the inner workings of the LEGO Super Mario universe. I'll also be giving you a little peek at what we have to come. Now, full disclosure, ever since we announced this stream a few days ago, uh, I've read a lot of people are tuning in right now expecting to see some kind of product reveal. So how about we just start with one right away? Let's go see what LEGO designer Didier has to show us. Hi, happy Mario Day! I'm Didier, Senior Interactive Play Designer on the LEGO Super Mario team, and today we have something big to share with you. A first look at one of the newest expansion sets in the LEGO Super Mario universe, the Tri Bowser Castle Battle expansion set. And who better to walk you through them than the hero himself? Happy Mario Day! So, one of the first things you have to figure out with this set is how to get in, because there is fire and the entrance seems closed. But if you walk on the side and watch out for magma, then you can find the secret entrance and walk inside the castle. Wow! Once inside, you'll see dry Bowser's hidden lair and purple toad trot. But don't worry, little toad, Lego Mayo is here. Let's go. Ooh, I have to be very sneaky now. Oh. Yeah, that felt nice. It is time to kick out Dry Bowser. Let's use the crane. Oh, that was amazing. But there are so many other fun pieces to the set. You can work out in Bowser's gym. Ooh, yeah. Well, let me show you another little secret. If you see here, there is a key block. If you scan it, and then come down here to the secret door, there is something very special in it. What is it? Well, I guess you'll have to wait and find out on your own. We are so excited for you to find out all the hidden secrets and play with this new set. Now I'll hand it back to Jack. Happy Maya Day. What an amazing build. I've always loved Dry Bowser. It's so cool that he is joining the LEGO Super Mario universe. And now it's time to get ready for some big builds, because next up are some inside scoops about the adult Mighty Bowser build and our king-size Bowser that has been touring the world. But let's start with the amazing journey of how the Mighty Bowser came to life from the concept to the final build. Here is LEGO senior designer Carl to take us through the journey. A few years ago, I was playing around making a robotic moving model called Percy, which, funnily enough, sparked the idea in 2020 to make a big, buildable, movable Bowser figure that would come to life. This idea began my year-long mission to bring the mighty Bowser build to reality, and I gave it the codename Percy. The project started by looking through reference photos of Bowser from different Super Mario games, but he didn't really come together until we got a full 360-degree reference from the Nintendo team. Then, I made a one-to-one -one printout at the scale I wanted to build Bowser. I knew I wanted Bowser to move, but that proved to be a tough task. We tried all kinds of ways to bring him to life, from motors in his platform to him spinning on his shell. But the most important thing was making sure his looks stayed true to his character and the motors made him seem too much like a robot. I took a step back and decided that puppet-style functions were way more fun to play with and made him better to display. Once we figured out how to make him move, we were pretty much at the finish line but something we were having trouble with was the shell. The elements we had just weren't the right shape, so we created the beautifully bulbous 3x3x3 O-Drive piece. This was the perfect piece to capture the curves of Bowser's shell spikes. Then there was a new challenge, the angles of the shell. I had to figure out how to get all 10 sections of the shell angled independently. I ended up asking for a lot of help from the design team to get this exactly right. Next, he needed a stage. We went through so many different versions of his platform and landed on something that felt like it was part of his castle and made him the center of attention. After the build came the name. It felt natural to give him an epic name and the Mighty Bowser was a great fit. Overall, the development of the Mighty Bowser took almost an entire year. I built seven totally different versions of him and at least 30 designers helped with the design in some way. 
And that was only the build. After that, it goes into the hands of even more teams within the LEGO group so people can bring the mighty Bowser home. But the thing I'm most proud of is the building experience. We were able to make him so fun to build. I want to thank everyone from the teams that brought this big guy to life. We all hope you love him as much as we do. Now that was one king-size Bowser build. <laughs> so for the rest, oh wait, we're forgetting one, we're forgetting one. Thank you very much. Look, a friend. So for the rest, and now one more. There we go. Thank you. So for the, <laughs> how amazing is this? I think there's now so many versions of Lego Bowser that I can't actually hold you all. Uh, <laughs> we really need to move on to the next segment. <laughs> So, the rest of the show will be focused on ages 6 plus. So gather round because we have a huge LEGO Super Mario fan who's going to show off the new products that have just come out. Bless you. Hi, I'm April. To celebrate Mario Day, the LEGO Group sent me a package which included the LEGO Super Mario Adventures with Peach Starter Course, the latest creativity toolbox, and Conkdoor's Noggin Bopper to build my own level. Let's see what we can build! What a journey this has been. You know, we've seen a product reveal, watched the mighty Bowser become the amazing build it is today. I just hope you've all enjoyed it as much as I have. But today is obviously also about celebrating Mario. And it kind of feels like we haven't really seen enough of our hero just yet. So let's bring back Lego Mario one more time so he can give you a sneak peek into something truly wild. The LEGO Super Mario universe is about to get even bigger, with more adventures, exciting characters, and new worlds. Keep an eye out for more details coming soon. But to sign off from the stream, we're going to be celebrating Mario Day with you, our LEGO Super Mario fans, and your creations. These are all real photos and videos submitted by you, so thank you so much for sharing your builds with us. And of course, to all of you, you really are the best fans that we could ask for. So I guess that all that's left to say is...